I will exalt you, my God, O King. And with gratitude and submissive wonder, I will bless your name forever and ever. Every day, I will bless you and lovingly praise you. Yes, with awe-inspiring reverence, I will praise your name forever and ever. Great is the Lord and highly to be praised. And his greatness is so vast and profound as to be unsearchable, incomprehensible to man. One generation shall praise your works to another and shall declare your mighty and remarkable acts on the glorious splendor of your majesty and on your wonderful works, I will meditate. People will speak of the power of your awesome acts and with gratitude and submissive wonder, I will tell of your greatness. They will overflow like a fountain. And when they speak of your greatness and abundant goodness and will sing joyfully of your righteousness, the Lord is gracious and full of compassion slow to anger, and abounding in loving kindness. The Lord is good to all, and his tender mercies are over all of his works. The, the, in, the entirety of things created. And your works shall give thanks to you and praise you, O Lord. And your godly ones will bless you. They shall speak of the glory of your kingdom and talk of your power to make known to the sons of men your mighty acts and the glorious majesty of your kingdom. Your kingdom is an everlasting kingdom and your dominion endures throughout all generations. The Lord upholds all those of his own who fall and rises up all those who are bowed down. The eyes of all look to you in hopeful expectation and you give them their food in due time. You open your hand and satisfy the desire of every living thing. The Lord is unwavering, unwaveringly righteous in all his ways and gracious and kind in all his works. The Lord is near to all who call on him and to all who call on him in truth without guile. He will fulfill the desire of those who fear and worship him with awe-inspiring reverence and obedience. He also will hear their cry and will save them. The Lord keeps all who love him, but all the wicked he will destroy. My mouth will speak the praise of the Lord and all flesh will bless and gratefully praise his holy name forever and ever. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. O oh, my soul, while I live, I will praise the Lord. I will sing praises to my God as long as I live. Do not trust in princes, any mortal man in whom there is no salvation or help. When his spirit leaves him, he returns to the earth. And that very day, his thoughts and plans perish. How blessed and graciously favored is he whose help is the God of Jacob, Israel, whose hope is in the Lord, his God, who made heaven and earth, the sea and all that is in them, who keeps truth and is faithful forever who executes justice 
for the oppressed, who gives food to the hungry. The Lord sets free the prisoners. The Lord opens the eyes of the blind. The Lord lifts up those who are bowed down. The Lord loves the righteous, the upright in heart. The Lord protects the strangers. He supports the fatherless and the widow, but he makes crooked the way of the wicked. The Lord shall reign forever. Your God, O Zion, to all generations, praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord, for it is good to sing praises to our gracious and majestic God. Praise is becoming and appreciating, appropriating. The Lord is building up Jerusalem. He is gathering together the exiles of Israel. He heals the brokenhearted and binds up their wounds healing their pain and comforting their sorrow. He counts the number of the stars. He calls them all by their names. Great is our majestic and mighty Lord and abundant in strength. His understanding is inexhaustible, infinite, boundless. The Lord lifts up the humble. He casts the wicked down to the ground. Sing to the Lord with thanksgiving. Sing praises to our God with the lyre, who covers the heavens with clouds, who provides rain for the earth, who makes grass grow on the mountains. He gives to the beasts its food and to the young ravens that for which they cry. He does not delight in the strength, military power of the horse, nor does he take pleasure in the leg strength of a man. The Lord favors those who fear and worship him with awe-inspiring reverence and obedience. Those who wait for his mercy and loving kindness Praise the Lord, O Jerusalem. Praise your God, O Zion. For he has strengthened the bars of your gates. He has blessed your children within you. He makes peace in your borders. He satisfies you with the finest of wheat. He sends his command to the earth. His word runs very swiftly. He gives to the earth snow like a blanket of wool. He scatters the forest like ashes. He casts out his ice like fragrance. Who can stand before his cold? He sends out his word and melts the ice. He causes his word to blow and the waters to flow. He declares his word to Jacob, his statutes and his ordinance to Israel. He has not dwelt or dealt this way with any other nation. They have not known, understood, appreciated, heeded, or cherished his ordinances. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Praise the Lord from the heavens. Praise him in the heights. Praise him all his angels. Praise him all his hosts, armies. Praise him sun and moon. Praise him all stars of light. Praise him highest heavens and the waters above the heavens. Let them praise the name of the Lord. 
for he commanded and they were created. He has always established them forever and ever. He has made a decree which shall not pass away. Praise the Lord from the earth. Sea monsters and all deeps, lightning and hail, snow and fog, stormy winds, fulfilling his orders, mountains and all hills, fruitful trees and all cedars, beasts and all cattle, creeping things and winged birds, kings of the earth and all people, princes and all judges of the earth, both young men and virgins, old men and children. Let them praise the name of the Lord for his name alone is exalted, supreme, and his glory and majesty are above earth and heaven. He has lifted up a horn for his people, giving them strength, prosperity and dignity and prominence. Praise for all his godly ones, for the people of Israel, a people near to him. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Sing to the Lord a new song and praise him in the congregation of his godly ones, believers. Let Israel rejoice in their maker. Let Zion's children re rejoice in their king. Let them praise his name with dancing. Let them sing praises to him with the tambourine and lyre. For the Lord takes pleasure in his people. He will beautify the humble with salvation. Let the godly ones exalt in glory. Let them sing for joy on their beds. Let the high praises of God be in their throats and a two-edged sword in their hands to execute vengeance on the nations and punishment on the peoples, to bind their kings with chains and their nobles with fetters of iron to execute on them judgment written. This is the honor for all his godly ones. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Praise the Lord. Praise God in his sanctuary. Praise him in his mighty heavens. Praise him for his mighty acts. Praise him according to the abundance of his greatness. Praise him with the trumpet sound. Praise him with the harp and lyre. Praise him with tambourine and dancing. Praise him with stringed instrument and flute. Praise him with resounding cymbals. Praise him with loud symbols. Let everything that has breath in every breath of life praise the Lord. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. 